Welcome viewers, this is Green Gaia Tarot and this is your Full Moon Yes or No Pick a Card reading. So take a deep breath, think about your question or questions and select your option or options from pile number 1, 2, and 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 and we will start the reading from pile number 1. Welcome pile number 1, this is your Full Moon Yes or No Pick a Card reading. So hopefully you have ready you have your question ready by now let's see what we have for you in the tarot as the answer your first card is the page of coins next we have the hanged man and the final card is four of swords okay pile number one i see a no for you Whatever you are asking at this point of time, it is not a mature choice and you need to develop more in-depth knowledge or idea about it and for that, through that you will be able to change your point of view and the final card is the four of swords and this is the card that tells you to stand down from that matter you need to either postpone or cancel the matter that you are asking at this point of time this is not something that will give you the best results at this point of time so pile number one you've got a no Let's see what we have for you in the Oracle cards. Okay, you got a leg up. So you need more help in this matter. And as you can see, I was telling you, the energy is not mature. You can see this is a baby cub, sorry, a cub and a mama. So the cub needs help from the mama so you are not in a very mature energy at this point of time in this matter i'm not telling you you are immature you don't know much about the matter you are asking at this point of time and this is something that is fairly new in your life and you will be needing help to pursue this matter so pile number one this was your full moon yes or no pick a card reading if you like my reading, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share, subscribe and comment. Thank you very much for your participation. Have a great day. Welcome pile number two. This is your full moon yes or no pick a card reading. Hopefully you have your question ready by now. Let's see what we have for you in the tarot. Your first card is knight of coins. Then you have... The Ten of Cups and the final card is Six of Swords. So pile number two, you've got a yes as I can tell you. With the Knight of Coins, the matter will take time because Knight of Coin is the slowest coin, sorry, is the slowest knight in the tarot. So whatever you are asking at this point of time, you've got a yes, but this will take time strategy planning and you being more prepared to proceed forward because whatever it is it is sorry it have the immense blessing into it it can be something really big beautiful and abundant and it can definitely bring you out from the troubled water to the calmer one and you will feel really safe and in sync with the situation in future but it will take time and work so pile number two you've got a yes let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards yes you've got the higher power so you are blessed by the divine and higher power is at play things will work out in divine timing you don't have to feel rushed or don't let your ego speak louder 
because divine timing is not your timing or what you expect it will happen naturally you cannot force it or manipulate it so pile number two this was your full moon yes or no pick a card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great day welcome pile number three hopefully you have your question ready by now this is your full moon yes or no pick a card reading let's see what's the tarot have for you as the answer of your question your first card is nine of coins next you have king of wands then the final card is ace of coins okay money 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 because you've got all the cards as the coins i can tell if this is a money situation things are looking pretty good with this nine of coins this is something that is going to empower you very much you will feel confident wiser and experienced and there will be a very independent empowered energy in you by this situation you will feel that you are abundant and you will be able to take care of all of your responsibilities the very next card is the king of wands this is the card that tells that you will be really driven by your passion and you will be able to sorry this is king of wands i thought it was king of pentacles okay the king of wands is telling me that it is going to be something that if this is a job situation it is going to be something that you really wanted for a long time and it is here if this is something else definitely it is going to be a situation that is going to give you the advantage of being independent strong bold and very creative and you will be someone who will not only think about themselves but you will also inspire and help others your final card is the ace of coins this is the card that tells that there will be more opportunities abundance good fortune and blessings coming in this is something that is going to give you long run benefits so pile number three you've got the yes let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards yes you've got the to be fair card this is the card that tells that this is something that is definitely happening for you for your good karma and you need to be fair in your thoughts and in your deeds to achieve all the blessings as you can see the cards number is 38 38 that is 11 the angel number is here for you so don't be influenced by anyone or anything and always follow the path of fairness so pile number three this was your full moon yes or no pick a card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great day welcome pile number four this is your full moon yes or no pick a card reading hopefully you have your question ready by now let's see what's the tarot have for you as the answer your first card is the magician okay your next card is the high priestess good god your next card is the fool okay let me tell you what is happening the fool card the major arcana is zero you have this the magician is another mag major arcana that is just the next number the magician number one and then you have the high priestess number two zero one two you have 
the most synchronistic spread that can ever come on a live spread where I just picked out the cards. There is no trick or no nothing. So you can trust this reading wholeheartedly. Whatever you are asking, pile number four, this is a very blessed situation. You can see that all three major arcanas are here for you. The new beginning is here, the blessings of pursuing your dreams into your reality is here. It is the right time, it is the right moment for you. With the High Priestess, I can tell for sure you have the knowledge, you have the power. You know what to do, how to do it. And you have the confidence as the magician always have it. You are the confident one. And you have a mind with full of imagination and openness like a child to move forward. So pile number four, whatever you are asking, this is a big, loud, clear and bold yes from the universe for you. This is really, really beautiful. Whatever you are asking, it is a yes. You will be able to pursue your dreams into your reality. In time, you will see it is going to flourish and you know what to do. And knowledge is something that is going to empower you throughout the journey of this matter. So pile number four, this was the tarot for you. Let's see what we have for you in the Oracle cards. You've got the Orphan card. This is the card that tells that this is the journey that you are going to take by yourself. This is something solely your journey. You might not see anyone around you, but always have faith that the divine is there. Don't waste a single minute thinking that you are alone. You won't be able to do it. You are very much blessed with all the possibilities and you can pursue everything. Let me give you another synchronicity. This card is number five. The pile number is four. So you have zero, one, two, four and five. The three is missing, but the cards, the tarot cards are three. So you have all the numbers lined up for you. This is something that is very much aligned. I can sense from the card, the orphan card is telling me that you are very worried. And that's why the universe you giving, sorry, the universe giving you this much bigger of a nudge. Have faith, have confidence, have trust that you can do it. You will be able to do it and there will be nothing that is going to stop you from becoming the very best, from achieving the very best. So pile number four, this is going to be a very important reading for you. You can come back to this reading anytime when you feel that whatever you were asking have come to your life with blessings. So this was your full moon yes or no pick a card reading. If you like my reading, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share, subscribe and comment. Thank you very much for your participation. Have a great day. Welcome pile number five. This is your full moon yes or no pick a card reading. Hopefully you have your question ready by now. Let's see what's the tarot have for you. Okay, your first card is the Empress. Next you have the Queen of Cups. And then you have the Six of Cups. Okay, let me tell you. If you are 
someone who is looking for a good news of childbirth i can tell you that there is a possibility of that situation happening if that is your question you've got a yes the empress is the one who is the mother who gives the birth to new possibilities and the future the abundant future the queen of cup is the mother who takes care of all the responsibilities and the loved one around her with care and love and the six of cups also indicates about a child or better say childhood joys and happiness so if some any of you out there who is here today in this pile looking for a good news regarding a child birth you need to remain positive and have the assurance that blessings are there for you for others this is a big yes because the empress the major arcana tells about the abundant future possibilities and good fortune the queen of cups is the one who is someone very empowered with love care and abundance also and the six of cups is telling about second chances or someone or something coming back into your life that is going to bring in joyful memories or will create joyful memories so pile number 5 this is a big yes let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards yes you've got the peace card so this is something that is going to bring in the peace for you and you will feel that the universe is blessing you so pile number 5 this was your full moon yes or no pick a card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great day So viewers this was your full moon yes or no pick card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great day happy full moon